Your NBC 26 Storm Tracker forecast with Chief Meteorologist Chris Still. You weren't seeing things out there today. We definitely have had some snowflakes flying out there today. It's been off and on, very light in nature, and we're not talking about a major winter event or anything like that. Those snowflakes will continue to fly off and on throughout the evening. Notice you have little patches of the snow that forms. Basically what happens, you have a lot of wind energy upstairs in the atmosphere, and that gets the atmosphere kind of ripply. Think of a windy day at the lake where you have those waves bouncing up. You get some rising motion, a little patch of snow. Then you have some sinking air, and the air goes back up. So kind of a wavy atmosphere producing these waves of light snow out there this evening. And that's going to continue through your evening hours. Here's your out and about forecast tonight. 39 degrees out there, so the temperatures are above freezing. We're not going to get down to freezing until about midnight tonight, but by that time, the snow flurries will be over, and that's why we're not going to see any accumulation. Besides, the snow is very, very light. Now, here's a look at it on our forecast tracker model. Don't pay too close of attention to exactly where the snow is. Just notice that it is here in the CSRA. 7 o'clock tonight, we're showing our computer model is that potential for uh, some light snow showers at times, off and on, but again, very little or no accumulation expected. If you did get any accumulation, it would be on the grassy surfaces, and as soon as it melts, within about an hour, it's going to be gone. Our ground is very warm out there. By midnight tonight, as I said, I think most of, if not all of the snow that we do see out there tonight will be gone. Sky's clear overnight. It's going to be a very windy and cold day again tomorrow. Wake up temperatures in the middle 20s, highs tomorrow only in the lower 40s. So how in the world are we seeing snow? Well, what you're looking at here is a forecast sounding. Basically, the way computer models work is around the world, they release weather balloons into the sky. It measures the temperature and the humidity from the ground all the way up to the edge of the atmosphere. And this is a virtual sounding generated for the Augusta area. That's the temperature, that's the dew point. When they're close together, you have high humidity. Well, snow forms where the temperature is about 10 to 20 degrees below zero, and that's what we have going on there where those two lines are close together. So a thin layer of moisture in just the right spot out there today, and voila, you have a few snow flurries, even though the temperature outside is 39 degrees. It feels cold out there, too. A west wind tonight at 10. That makes the feels-like temperature 32. Current temperatures around the area are in the 40s down to the south, 44 in Sylvania, 38 in Edgefield. But notice everyone is above freezing, but it does feel very cold. Current feels like temperature of 27 in Aiken. Overnight tonight, that 30% chance of light snow will persist this evening. No accumulation, the low 23 in Thompson, 26 in Sylvania. Tomorrow, windy cold day, 43 in Waynesboro. Winds gusting near 30 miles per hour. And a quick look at your seven-day forecast. The average high temperature is 61 degrees. We're going to be nowhere near that any time soon. So cold is the word. Oh, it is cold out there. Thanks, Chris.